Let God be true, and every man a liar. God has promised to preserve his word, and he has kept that promise by preserving his word in the authorized King James Version of the Bible. Now, natural man does not like what God has written. And natural man hates the Word of God. So natural man has decided to rewrite a book and put the words Holy Bible on the outside. There are many, many, many perversions of the Bible on the market today. It's a money-making scheme. The authorized King James Version is public domain. And in order to get a copyright on these new Bibles, they have to change them, and they have done that. Now, if it's a matter of opinion about this and that or the other thing, and it's any religion will do, but if you're looking for the truth, the truth is in the Word of God. The truth is not in religion. You can be religious and end up dying and going to a place the Bible calls hell. Religious people that have never been born again, never been born of the Spirit, never been what the Bible calls saved. It says in John 3, 16, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. John 3, 16. John 3.17 says, For God sent not his Son into the world to condemn the world, but that the world through him might be saved. A natural man does not want to come to the light of the word. Why? Because natural man is in darkness and he does not want light shone upon his evil deeds. He wants to stay in his sin. Jesus said, and you will not come to me that you might have life. Satan is up busy, as busy can be, in capturing the minds of people all over the world. And he's doing it through new perversions of the Bible, mostly. I challenge you to honestly come to the authorized King James Version of the Bible and read it and be able to walk away saying, no, this is not true, this is not the Word of God. Many have come with an honest, open heart. Even some have come to try and disprove what's in the Bible, and they've walked away saying, like the soldier said, after the Lord had died on the cross, truly, this was the Son of God. And you will come to believe what God has said if you open this Bible, read it, and ask God to show you what you need to know. Thank you for listening.